Economic hardship, social inequality, and an educational achievement gap are all parts of Israeli society. Inside this reality, Ma'agalim is working to break this terrible cycle. Come take a closer look. אני חוזרת הביתה מהבית ספר, והדלת מעולה, ואימא שלי צועקת לי מאחורי הדלת, תחפשי לך בית אחר. זו תחושה מאוד קשה. אז אני יוצאת החוצה, ואני חושבת מה לעשות. מחליטה שבסדר, אני אהיה ברחוב, וזה הרבה יותר עדיף מאשר הבית. כילד, היה הרבה פעמים שחברים מבית ספר הולכים לטיול, וצריך לשלם על הטיול, ו... כי אין כסף איך שלנו לטיול. חבר'ה שלך יש לו חולצה חדשה, או שיש חג, ותמיד היה לנו חלומות גבוהים, אבל בתכלס בשטח ידענו שזה לא באמת מה שיקרה. זה הגיע למצב שהייתי בדיוק באמצע קורס חופשים. אבא שלי התקשר אליי באמצע הקורס, והוא סיפר לי, איציק נתחיל לנו את החשמל, אין מה לאכול בבית וזה. זה היה רגע מאוד מאוד קשה. התפרקתי, בכיתי הרבה, נשברתי. These teens are just a few of the hundreds of youth who are handicapped from the very beginning. Their futures are far from promising, and they have no belief that a better life is possible. In the bleak reality of their lives, they need a strong supporting hand stretched out towards them. Here is where Ma'agalim enters the picture, understanding that these youth are at a critical crossroads in their lives, and they simply must, must keep their heads above water. אנחנו פוגשים את הנוער של מעגלים בפריפריה המוחלשת. ושם מעגלים נמצאת. שם מעגלים נותנת להם כלים לשנות את החיים שלהם. אבל בעיקר, בעיקר, לשים את עצמם על מסלול של הצלחה בחיים. It starts with hard work on a daily basis, taking responsibility and having faith in people. Those who take off and soar give us the strength to continue. זה באמת בזכות המדריך הזה שהיה שם וניגב את הדמות הקטנות האלה. השינוי לא קורה ברגע, הוא לא קורה ביום אחד, והוא קרה ועדיין קורה בזכות מעגלים. There are thousands of other young people standing today on the edge, within the circles of violence, crime and neglect. They need our help. Join the family of Ma'agalim and help us to help them get on the path to success. I now invite Justice Minister Ayelet Shaked to join us back on stage to present to Safwais for Ma'agalim with an award recognizing their contribution to Israeli society. Minister Shaked and Asafwais. Thank you to the Jerusalem Post for honoring Ma'agalim and thank you for being here today. How can I share with you the stories of thousands of at-risk youth on three minutes? I cannot, but I can tell you one. I want to tell you a personal story of Ezri, a Magalim graduate. Ezri came to Magalim six years ago, at risk youth, alone, with no hope for a future, no connection to Israel. If you would ask Ezri, if you would ask Ezri what he wants to do, in the IDF service, he would say, I don't want to go. It's not for me. Somebody else will do it. First chance I have, I want to leave Israel. 
as we came from bad neighborhood in Yerushalayim, place that brought him only trouble, violence, drugs, and crime. Big chance happened when Ezri came to Magalim. His madrich mentored him, believed in him, and showed him he is important. His madrich gave him hope that he can make a difference to society and to Israel country. Now, six years after mentoring from Magalim, Ezri became a commander in an elite unit in the IDF. <laughs> With a very successful future. Ezri, but the important point is that Ezri came out of the risk world in which he came from. Ezri's story is like many of thousands of at-risk youth in Israel that Magalim worked with in the last 18 years. It's all thanks to our believing Israel at-risk youth, understanding that they must make a, cha a change for a better future for them and for Israel. Today, Ezri came to here to share with you his private story. Ezri, please. Shalom. My name is Ezri Ushalmi, and it's an honor for me to be here with you representing Mangalim. When I look back on my life, I never could have imagined that I would be where I am today. And where I am today could never have happened without Magalim. Since I was young, I saw friends and people in my neighborhood avoid an enlisting in the IDF. They would fake their health situation in order not to be in the IDF. During Magalim weekly in school group lessons, Isa, my counselor, explained the importance of military service, of how and why we need to protect and defend our country, defend the Jewish people. I started to question my path in life. It was the one person in my life that said I mattered. He truly saw me, saw my potential. He helped me realize that I could dream, that I could do something with my life. Izar inspired me to enlist as a combat soldier. In July 2013, during Operation Protective Edge, my unit took part in fighting and clearing the tunnels that Hamas had dug in order to enter Israel. In one of these operations, in one of these tunnels, my dear friend, Nagdar Goldin, was kidnapped by Hamas. The day before this operation, we spoke about the importance of what we were doing for Israel. We both said how much we missed being home with our families. But he was killed, and he never had a chance to go home again. When I came home from fighting and told my parents how it was like and what happened to Adar, they took me in their arms and cried. They told me how proud they were of me, how special I was to them and their Israel. When I think back on how I was before the IDF, if it had not been for Magalim, I would not have helped to defend my country by leading missions that led to arrest terrorists in West Bank and Gaza. I would not have served for three years in the IDF. I would not be in the second year at university studying computer science. 
Thank you. And I would not marry to my lovely wife with a little baby on the way. Thank you. I would be in a completely different place. I am here to say thank you. Thank you to Magalim. Thank you to Asaf. You changed my life. You really saved my life. And I am only of more than 8,000 at risk youth of Israel you have today. We are the future of Israel. Now that I see all of us gathering together under the same roof where the main subject spoken is Am Israel, I say with a great passion, Am Israel Chai. Am Israel Chai. Am Israel Chai. Am Israel Chai. Am Israel. Am Israel. Am Israel Chai. Thank you. Thank you for Rezvi. Thank you.